some of us may be a little surprised when someone randomly knocks on the door, but the new game show, Cash at Your Door, hosted by Jason Biggs, may have you rethinking that. Take a look. Oh, what the fuck? There you go. I'm Jason Biggs, and this is Cash at Your Door. Our producers have told these unsuspecting homeowners they'll be taking part in a non-existent show about their home. I'm so confused right now, like, what's <laughs> happening? Instead, I'm about to offer them a chance to win a fat stack of cash. I have cash that I would like to give to you. One, two, that is yours. If they make it to the end of three rounds of trivia, that's the one thing I was going to get right. They'll win $25,000. And Jason is here with me now. Biggs, what up? How are you? What up, Gore? We would always answer the door if you knocked on it. But tell us a little bit about this show. Tell us about the concept. Yeah, it's called Cash at Your Door. It's pretty, it's all there in the title. So uh, it's from the producers of Cash Cab, if you're familiar with that show. Basically, I'm showing up at these people's houses. They have no idea um, that I'm showing up. They have no idea it's a game show. They have no idea they could win 25K for answering trivia questions correctly. But it was so much fun. As you can yeah. imagine as well, but, you know, the, the, the timing of the show, filming it, you know, during the craziness that, is is upon us this last year and a half yeah. you can imagine uh i made a lot of people happy um yeah it was uh it was really cool break it down for me how is it kind of how are the houses chosen like could you show up at my doorstep you know i don't know how they cast this show but i can tell you that the casting uh uh people are brilliant because you know we filmed all around the tri-state area um, but it was such an amazing cross-section of people. Like, for the most part, it was larger groups of, of people and kids. And, you know, and we would, like I said, we would catch these people off guard. You know, they didn't know exactly when we were coming. They, they thought they were going to be filming a show about their homes. They thought, you know, it was going to be like a Sarah Gortz style show. Right. And then Jason Biggs shows up. And they were like, we were hoping for someone a lot for Where's Sarah? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, and then there I am. Yeah. What was your favorite part of meeting these strangers and kind of going into their home and learning a little bit about them? Well, you know, I mean, there was definitely, you know, given the timing of it, talking to people about how their last year has been, you know, people had lost their jobs. A lot of yeah. people um, had to sort of recalibrate their whole lives and homeschooling. And, and so obviously there's a shared, you know, sense of, wow, we're all, everyone is going through this in some way, shape or form. Obviously I made a lot of people that people's days, you know, yeah, they that had feels no idea. pretty good. Yeah, they, they knew they were going to be filming some show about their home, and then three hours later, they win $11,000. And they're like, did that just happen? But listen, on the flip side of the comedy, though, you're starring in this film called The Subject, which is, it's, a, it's really pretty dark. Yeah, not funny at all. So The Subject is uh, about this guy, this documentary filmmaker, who has gotten kind of a, a, a lot of success uh, based specifically on this one film, it's won a lot of awards, and it comes out that uh, he actually filmed the main subject's uh, death. And so it raises all of these sort of moral questions. Was he able to do something about it? Could he have done something about it? Well, and it's been racking up awards on the festival circuit, and that it comes out next year, right? Yeah, yeah, yep. And yeah. what do you hope people take away from watching it? I think like a lot of good movies, you know, it, a it asks a lot of questions. And I hope that they, you know, see me for the brilliant, dramatic actor that I am, Sarah. You yes. know, it's been something I've been hiding from the public for a long yes. time. Right. Well, I, we saw a lot of that drama in American Pie, which is just celebrated its 20th anniversary. When you look back at it now, what are your thoughts on it uh, 20 years later? Oh my gosh. You know, it's it's hard for me to look back on it as just a movie and not a full experience and a life-changing thing, you know, because it's not just a movie to me. It's filled with nostalgia. I look back with immense gratitude. And, you know, the movie's still funny. Well, listen, I, I um, we got to have dinner soon. I would love it. You can catch the premiere of Cash at Your Door tonight on E! Jason, good to see you, my friend. Thanks, Sarah. So great to see you.